series, Traffic Classification. Nowadays, we enjoy benefits brought by technologies. Thanks to queues, multiple services such as internet access, voice, and a video can be connected at the same time with their quality guaranteed. Queues is a service model which has complete components or architecture. Traffic classification is one of the basic queues components. What is traffic classification? Traffic classification is also called packet classification, which is used to differentiate between Ethernet packets according to a certain rule. After the differentiation, irregular Ethernet packets are put into different groups, and the packets and groups have the same characteristics. Why is traffic classification needed? Multiple services are connected, and they need to be identified first. In ancient times, people have only carriages, and therefore no lane is needed. Along with the development of ages, people use vehicles in their daily lives. These vehicles have different models, speeds, and special functions. To improve efficiency, we need more lanes to fork traffic. From this example, we can see that service flows of different classifications are used for different services. How to implement traffic classification? Traffic classification is presented by classification rules or named the filtering rules. Classification is performed on Ethernet packets on the logical port of the access device. Classification rules are formulated based on the three fields in the header of the Ethernet frame and their combinations. The three fields are VLAN, priority, and Ethernet type. If a rule cannot be identified, field combination is required. For example, we take Ethernet packets as vehicles, take VLAN, Ethernet type, and priority as three attributes of a vehicle. In this case, the classification result indicates the lane. Taking classification based on VLAN vehicle type as an example. Packets are identified as cars, large-sized vehicles, and buses, and are distributed to their own lanes. In actual applications, if voice, video, and broadband services in our homes are identified by VLAN, similarly, these three services are transmitted over different channels. After traffic classification, the first step in queues processing is complete. Just like after we differentiate between vehicles, we can formulate driving rules. This is traffic classification. Let's see in the next issue. Q series: Priority Marketing.